Look, it's the middle of summer and it's snowing, it's snowing, it's snowing. Hello everybody, it's Peter once again and time for another product review. Let's get into it. And today's product review is of the Antari SW250 snow machine. This unit weighs in at 13 kilograms, which is 27 pounds. It has a tank capacity of five liters and a fuel consumption of four liters per minute. Okay, um, on the back we plug her in, uh, switch her on. And if you have a look at the LED unit at uh, the top left, as soon as you turn it on, it boots up. And the words that you're looking for are ready to snow. As soon as they come on, the unit's ready to fire, assuming, of course, we have our um, snow liquid in. The tank takes five litres. Um, make sure that the uh, filter part at the bottom, which stops all the uh, gubbins getting in, goes right to the bottom. The top is screwed uh, securely on because we don't want any leakages. So at this point, I've got an apology to make. A little while ago, I posted a YouTube video reviewing the QTX SW2 snow machine. I ended up giving it favourable reviews, but one category that I admitted was reliability. After 10 months, the thing conked out, and that is why now I've purchased my new Antari unit. Looking at the output from the front of the uh, Antari, superb. And if you compare it then to the QTX, the QTX looks almost as if it's spitting the snow out, whereas the Antari is fluffy. I mean, just look at that. That's absolutely, it just looks like some sort of blizzard. It's fantastic. Um, and the coverage is superb. It looks fluffy. Let's have a quick look from the back. You can see it's running at 100%. The snow getting chucked everywhere. Uh, I'm telling you now for a fact, it's going to 20 feet. There is little to no wind in the garden. That's 20 feet of snow long and about 20 feet wide. And if you look at the coverage, it actually looks like real snow. I've walked through the snow in the garden because you can still see my footprints. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is review the machine and break it down into four categories. Quality, performance, reliability and value. In terms of quality, this thing is rock solid. It weighs in at about 13 kilograms, but once you've got a full tank, you can add on another couple of kilograms to that. If you're going to suspend it from a gantry, make sure it is a rock solid gantry capable of supporting this weight. So in terms of quality, I'm going to give it a fantastic nine out of 10. So now we're going to have a look at performance. Now bear in mind that I've only had this machine about six or seven weeks. It's not let me down. It's absolutely fantastic. The type of snow, the fluffy snow that it projects, you saw in the clip before. It's really good quality stuff, projecting around about 20 feet. So performance, yet another nine out of 10. So in terms of reliability, ever since I first opened this thing, it's worked first time. It's done exactly what it's meant to do. Now, the adaptive snow um, output on the back, if you're on an internal hull, perhaps with a uh, wooden floor, you're gonna want to take the snow output down maybe to 50%, because you've got to be aware that maybe you have slip, uh, slippy floors. If you're at an outdoor festival or any outdoor event, knock it up to 100%, no problems with slipping, and the output is superb. So, yet again, another nine out of 10 value. This thing is expensive. If we compare it to the other snow machine that you had a look on the uh, video before, that was 120 pounds. This thing was about 450 pounds UK sterling. Is it worth the extra? Yes, it is, absolutely. Um, it's, a different, uh, it's a different gravy, it's, uh, it's, it's superb. And it really gives a proper snow output. So the question is, is it worth spending that extra money if you think it's over three times the cost of the model that I was looking at before? The answer is yes, yes, yes. Even if you're on a tight budget, 
consider investing in the best and it's like the old adage you get what you pay for here you get what you pay for rock solid superb quality excellent performance fantastic reliability so in view of that i'm going to give it nine out of ten for value so if you enjoyed this video please do feel free to subscribe give it the big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and hit that for further notifications once again great to see you thanks for watching